Safi'uddin al-Mashadani uses the cuneiform script of ancient Mesopotamia in his art and today works freely here in Mosul. So. But before Daesh was driven out a year ago, life was very different. Under the rule of the terror group, artists like him were beaten and imprisoned. Before the Iraqi security forces came to liberate us, I used to hide the things I made during the exhibition here in the basement. Artworks containing cuneiform were considered archaeological and banned by Daesh. Living under Daesh and with artist materials restricted or banned, Al Mashadani secretly used mud instead of clay to work into intricate pieces of art, decorated with the ancient cuneiform inscriptions. But now he can use clay again. Through my writing on clay tablets and exhibitions which we held at college, I had the idea of making something by mixing ancient civilization with our current times. I started making medals, necklaces and pieces to put on tables and decorations similar to those made by our ancient Iraqi ancestors. He says as a university graduate, it's hard to find work in Iraq and survive financially. But he's found a way to make a living from his rare form of art. Despite being Iraqis, we have no idea what cuneiform writing is. I was surprised to see Safa writing using the cuneiform system. He transforms our speech into the cuneiform system. I asked him about it, and he told me that these are the letters of our civilization that date back more than 7,000 years. Cuneiform may be an ancient art, but Mashadani says he's found a way to keep it and himself alive today. Nick Davis-Jones, TRT World.